how to achieve realistic coloring and shading in a methodical way. First, start off with your outline. Next, block out your colors and make sure that those are labeled and in separate layers. So you're doing your housekeeping at the same time. After that, you block in your shadows and block is very important. You're just trying to figure out your planes, where your light is coming from and where your shadows are coming from. Do this for all of the elements in your scene before moving on to the next step, which is cast shadows and ambient occlusions. You can do this on a separate layer, which gives you flexibility on adjusting your transparency. After that, you can go in and start to mask your shadows. So this is where you can see shadows closer to your object are going to be darker for the ambient occlusion. As you recede away, it's going to be lighter because you're going to get to reflective light. So this is where you start to see the form being built. And then after that, you can think about reflective and balanced light. The colors from this shape will reflect into the colors from the other shapes and vice versa. So then after that, you go in and do some final rendering. And that's just adding in some glossy edge highlights here. And then this is where you're starting to add in the fine details. And then you're beginning to render. All right, thanks so much.